OneSearch has some rich tools to help you find the articles that you need. To get started, enter your topic. I'm looking for articles on diversity in children's books. Before you hit enter, go ahead and limit your search to just articles. Now OneSearch is searching all 23 Cal State campus libraries. So I want to limit my results to just Cal State Fullerton so that I can do my research as quickly as possible. To do this, you should sign in so that OneSearch knows that you are affiliated with Cal State Fullerton. Now I can use some of the limiters on the left to limit our results to be even more relevant to me. I'm starting at 490,000 results, but I'm interested in only peer-reviewed articles, so I'm going to choose that limiter first. Next, I'm interested in looking at my articles immediately online, so I'm going to select that feature as well. Now I'm down to 110,000 results, and I'm also interested in limiting to just the last five years, so I can do that here entering 2012 and clicking Refine. Now I still have 29,000 articles, which is a lot, but my articles look much more relevant to what I'm interested in, and all of these have full text available. So to access an article, you can just click Full Text Available, and it'll automatically bring you down to the section where you can access that article. Clicking on the blue link will bring you to the database that actually contains the article, and from here you can read the article, or you can download it as well as a PDF. Now as I'm searching, I can do a few more interesting things. I can get a permalink to an article so that if I'm taking notes on the side, I can include the link and it'll always work. I can email the article to myself and my email address will be automatically populated because I'm signed in. I can generate a citation in my favorite citation style. Again, always double check for accuracy before you use these in your work. And if I'm using a citation manager, I can export this item to my manager, and I can also keep this item. If you click that little push pin, it'll save this article to a folder for you. You can find the folder by going back to your search results page, clicking on My Favorites, and then you'll see all the articles that you've saved. You can also save searches, and it'll also remember your search history, so that if you can't remember what searches you've already tried, you can go back here and check those out. Ready to start over? You can just click Reset Search, and all of your limiters will be cleared, and you can start searching for a new topic.